today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how to get custom text in Please Donate. So guys, here we are on Please Donate. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing you how you can get custom text in this game. In this video, we will cover on how to go ahead and change the font, how to change the color, which this person's done over here, and how to change the outline thickness of the text, and also how to um, mix and match text and all that sort of stuff. So as you guys can see here, a few people do have their text different colors, guys, but they're not really too custom. We're gonna, I'm going to be showing you guys today how to fully customize your text right now to make it absolutely crazy, and therefore allow you guys to get as many donations as possible, as your stand will really um, stand out a lot. So guys, I'm going to quickly claim up a booth right now. Here we go. And I'm going to be showing you guys how this works. But if you are ever in need of Robux and have a computer, go ahead and check out RBX Idle. This program allows you to earn Robux, gift cards, and more with simply a computer. This program has over 100,000 downloads and has already given out millions of Robux to a lot of players. All you have to do is go to the website and click on the download button. Or you can follow how I'm doing it on screen. You can earn with any computer and there is tons of ways to get prizes such as Robux, gift cards, Steam, Discord, Nitro. You can level up for rewards or win prizes and gold rush giveaways once you have the program ready and downloaded you guys can click on start earning and this will make your computer do the work completely for you to get started head to rbxidle.com or click on the link down below in the description and pinned comment so what i'm going to do here guys of course what you need to do hold down e to edit and this is going to be where we type in our text as you guys can see so guys first of all what you're going to want to do here is come to the link in the description and that is going to be on this pay spin link over here guys i found this from another youtube video so um of course guys credits to them i guess for this so pretty much you're going to want to go ahead and go to this pay spin link i'll link it down below it'll be in the description guys and then you're going to want to paste this in now guys for now this is pretty much where you guys change the text so let's hit subscribe you guys are going to want to delete that out and then it'll change the text text for example guys we can change our text to donate exclamation mark exclamation mark exclamation mark and if i click on apply guys as you can see it is now red and it's donate but i want to be showing us how you can change the colors and all that sort of stuff so we're gonna um edit this again so pretty much guys the stroke color what is a stroke well a stroke guys is the outline on the text so as you guys can see here guys this black bit here where my mouse is is the stroke and the red bit is the text itself so guys, if you go back into our booth, we can change the stroke um, to a different color. So right now, guys, it's black. Now, what I recommend you guys to do over here is this. Now, go to the link in the description, and you guys will find the Google Color Picker. And this will allow you guys to pick a color um, over here, guys, on the screen. So you can select any color right now. Let's say I want to make my text have completely white font. I'm just going to copy this thing this hashtag over here guys click on the copy button right now just over here and that'll copy my white text next i'm going to go back into the game and if i go ahead and paste this here and take away that and i click on apply guys as you guys can see my donate now has white outlines which is pretty cool and definitely quite um quite out there next guys you're going to want to go back here because thickness you guys can change your thickness right now for example um if i go a thickness of zero my text will not have any outline on, which um, I wouldn't really recommend that, guys. It doesn't really stand out too much unless you guys want to use that, guys. Or if I go for 10, as you guys can see, absolutely massive thickness right now. You know, guys, let's see what happens if I go 100 th thickness. Is that even possible? I'm not too sure. It is, guys. So, yeah, essentially, you got all the way up to like a thousand thickness or something, which is going to be kind of crazy. So, I'm just going to put mine back to, you know what, we'll put it put it to five i guess guys so as you guys can see we've got a nice little thick text next guys we have font size so you can change this for example guys i can just put my font size to nine which is going to be making it absolutely tiny i think potentially guys here um there might be like a max amount of, like um it, it might be limited to how big or how small you guys can put it i actually don't think guys that this seems to work at the moment because it's probably just done on scale um, yeah guys doesn't seem font size to work unfortunately guys but of course the font size all mark changes the more text you put in we'll put that back to 90. next guys font color of course you're going to want to go back to the color picker guys and you're going to want to use the same things as before so of course guys if i want let's say blue text i'd copy this there we go and now guys i'll go back into the game and i will then go ahead and paste in this color just over here guys click on apply as you guys can see we've got a pretty nice blue text it's actually perfect timing because this person is nearly the exact same blue as that text that we've just updated there now guys um 
we also have font too. So guys, the font is of course the style of text itself. So guys, on screen right now, here are some fonts that um, work in the game. You guys can pick one of these um, to change your font into. For example, guys, for Doka 1, um, this one is quite a popular font, guys, in a lot of Roblox games. If we go ahead and update this, um, click on apply, you guys can see here we got like now a more cartoony font. And let's say we want to go for a really, really bold one, we could try Luckiest Sky. So I'm going to use this again, guys, and I'm going to paste in Luckiest Sky. Click on apply, and as you guys can see, we've got quite a bold text this time. I'm not too sure. I'm going to try out, um, I'm going to try Impact. I'm not too sure if this one will work, guys. You can try it out. Does that one work? Never mind. <laughs> doesn't definitely doesn't seem to work there guys so i'm gonna put that back to fredoka one um just right now guys there we go um anyway so yeah that's pretty much how you guys can update your text however some people um have texts that are different um colors and stuff all in one thing so guys let's say i want to go ahead and make my stand say um don't please donate let's let's say we want to make our stand please donate just over here I click and apply. As you guys can see, it's all blue. But let's say I want my please to be red and my blue to be green. Well, what I'd go ahead and do over here is this. I will go ahead and delete the donut just to make this one word. I'd then copy this text and paste it in again. And if I go ahead and look for where it says please this time and click on um, and update that with donut and click and apply, it will still be please donut like this. Now, keep in mind, guys, because you are kind of putting two texts together, you guys must make sure to have either a space at the end of one or the start of another if you guys want spaces. So I'm going to put a space just over here, just so of course now it has a space. But how do I update the colors of this to make it different? Well, what I can do, of course, guys, is go back to stroke color. And let's say I want to make my stroke color for, please, back to black. As well, one second. I think I've added too many zeros there, guys. Um, let's wait one two three four five six there we go um so yeah if i want to please donate to be black as you guys can see my please is black and my donate is still white now guys i can update this even more and change the color of please to red so if i go ahead and put in the red code i've of course just used that same website guys as before and click and apply my please is now red and my donate a completely different color now guys let's say i want to make my donate green now um just here i'll go ahead and copy this um green um here we go i'll copy the green and i paste it in there guys and click on apply and now my donate is green and let's just say guys i want to maybe change the font of another one i could easily do that guys so well, let's pick another font from the list you know guys let's pick banners right in here and let's see guys this update so if i quickly change font face to bangers you guys can see here I've got two different font styles and um, colors and outlines, guys, all in here. So definitely, guys, it's a, you can really, really customize your booth with this, and it really does make you guys stand out. Uh, if you guys have a little look over here, my booth really does stand out a lot. So yeah, guys, definitely, you are going to want to be using the um, these methods in order to get donations a lot faster. So yeah, guys, that's pretty much how you guys can have custom font and text inside of your booth guys inside of please donate that's going to be it for this video here like and subscribe for more